adjusting to the dorms and everything like that, just kind of, does it take you back a little bit? Definitely take me back, man. You know, I was fortunate enough. I went to Virginia Tech. You know, we had nice facilities. Uh, you know, we had state-of-the-art food and everything, man. So, you know, I'm. it's not too bad. You know, a couple of days you get used to it, just used to being in your own space back home. But, I mean, it comes with it. You know, this is, this is part of camp, man. So, definitely at first I was like, I don't know. But, you know, the bears is a little soft. Feels pretty good, so I'm adjusting well, though. Do you fit in the bed? Yeah, I do. I do. Yeah, I do. Man, barely. My feet hanging off, but I'm comfortable, though. What's your favorite part about coming down here? Uh, I think just the team bonding, man. You know, I think just having everybody in, in a central location, uh, whether we just all just talking after practice or, you know, joking around, I mean, I think that goes a long ways as far as building a team. Uh, you know, obviously, just being back at our facility is more home to us. But, you know, when you come to this location, it forces guys just to hang out with one another. It forces guys to develop relationships with, you know, people that just got on the team, you know, that you might not know a lot. And uh, I think that's a big advantage, and uh, we could use that, and it'll go a long ways for us. Man, to be honest with you, I wake up with it. <laughs> you know, that's just me. Uh, it's been me, you know, since I was, you know, a kid. Uh, I just wake up wanting to be the best, wanting to be the best me I can be. And uh, just coming out here with my brothers, man, and just getting that energy from one another, that's all I need. You know, all I need to see is, or all I need to hear is, you know, something negative or not even that. It's just I, I wake up with it, man. I'm a, I'm a self-driven guy. Don't take much to get me going. And, you know, that's what created for me. Yeah, I mean, we all know Vaughn, man. We know what he's done in this league. We know the type of player he is. And I'm just excited to play with him, uh, you know, getting his head, just see what he's seen. Because, I mean, he's been playing ball at an extremely high level for a long time. And, you know, obviously it's going to, you know, raise some eyebrows for the offenses to, you know, adjust to him on the outside. And, you know, it's just, I'm excited to see where this thing goes. And, you know, we're just getting started, uh, obviously, with training camp, just starting, just developing that relationship and developing that bond. And, you know, I'm excited to see where it goes from here. Yeah, uh, well, first off, I mean, nothing we did last year is obviously going to carry over to this year. Um, if you was a part of this team last year, you just going to feel it, you know what I mean? But we can't look back, man. You know, you look back, you're going to trip going forward. So we just got to keep our heads on, keep keep striving for excellence, man. And, you know, don't even obviously remember what, what beat us, but at the same time, man, just continue to come out here and prove on what we, what we need to get better on. You said not about looking back, but you got Josh over there doing his interviews. You're <laughs> You know, it's crazy. I was checking in on our report date, and I'm like, man, it's, it's really been five years. Like, when you sit back and think about it, it doesn't feel like it, but, I mean, it's reality. But, uh, I mean, time is flying. You know, it's definitely flying. But, you know, this is this is the time now that we're in, and, you know, I'm excited for it, and, and I think it's it's going to be a good one. Yeah, I think we can get a set, an extra set of eyes on the sideline. You know, particularly for the young guys, that it means a lot. Uh, you know, just him sitting back and, you know, the young guys coming off, asking him questions, asking him what he see. And it's just like another coach on the sideline, you know, that you can probably relate to more because he's actually in, the, in that position playing with you. And, uh, I mean, I think that's the value it adds to you. I know when I was a young guy and, you know, we had guys like Lorenzo here um, that, you know, may have a vet day or something like that. I know I can come to the sideline and ask him a question and because uh, he's been in the same position I'm in. You know, sometimes a little bit different when you're out there versus, you know, come back hearing it from a coach. So just having that player connection that you can come back and just, you know, connect it to, connect to what he sees, to, you know, what I see on the field, I think that's good, and particularly for the young guys. Being one of the leaders on this defense, up to you with a guy like Holly come in, how does that kind of change having someone who is a clear leader like Bob? Does that change the dynamic of the defense? Having someone like, how do you kind of balance having different leaders and someone new like that? Yeah, it doesn't change anything. Uh, I mean, you know, it's not a thing that you can have one leader. You know, obviously you have somebody like that. Guys are just going to, you know, respect him just based off the things he's done across the league. And uh, it doesn't it doesn't change one bit. I mean, you know, we got great leaders. Uh, you know, myself, Poe, 
Micah, you know, the list goes on. I mean, a lot of guys that, you know, work at a high level, a lot of guys that a lot of guys respect. So, you know, it doesn't change one bit. Just another set of eyes, just another leader out there, you know, and particularly for the D-line and, you know, just for everybody just to, you know, go back and count on. We've talked so much to you over the last couple of years about playing fast. And, you know, the more you know, the more time you spend in this defense, you play faster. Cam Lewis and Tyrell Dotson. Yeah. It seems like this is going to be a year where early on, at least, before the pads come on, they seem to be playing pretty fast. Yeah, I mean, those two talented guys, uh, you know, every time Cam's out there, he's making a play. You know, I think a lot of guys can attest to that. Uh, it's been like that since day one, um, you know, so I'm excited to see, you know, where he takes this, excited to see where he goes. Same thing with Tyrell. I mean, we, the list goes on. You know, we got a lot of young guys playing at a high level, a lot of young guys, you know, taking this thing serious, man. And, you know, that's just take my hats off to the type of guys that we bring in. And, uh, I mean, guys just want to, you know, strive for excellence. Guys want to be better. And, uh, you know, in particular, Tyrell, I see him every day. Um, you know, obviously, linebacker. So I see the way he works. Uh, you know, we hold each other to, to a high standard in our room. So, you know, we just want to make each other better, you know, ultimately on the whole defense. Speaking of that, man, how does this new and improved defense You know, we'll see. You know, we'll see, man. I'm happy, for, I'm happy to have those guys, these guys here. Uh, we got a great group of guys, man, guys that love to work. I love the work, man, so I'm pretty sure it's going to mess well. Say it one more time. Right. Yeah, same thing, man. He's playing. He's playing well. You know, particularly for a rookie. You know, coming in. Uh, you know, you know, uh, there's a lot of, lot on, a lot of, lot at hand, and uh, he's doing a good well. He's doing a good job. You know, processing information and coming out here and applying it to the field. And uh, he made a play the other day. I think it was the first day. Made a nice play. And uh, you see, you know, some things coming up from him. But uh, he's definitely improving. Uh, he's definitely dialed in. And you can just see the focus when we're in meetings, when we're in walkthroughs, just little small stuff. And, you know, I'm excited to see where he takes it. You know, honestly, I think just being a new player, you know, when you step foot on the field and you just look around and see the way we work, you see the way guys that's been here for years work, I think it's just as a competitor, you can just feel that energy. You can feel like, okay, yeah, I got to step my game up, you know. So it's like, you know, if I was a new guy coming in, I just turned my head and looked around at the leaders. Like, as Evan, I can just see it like, yeah, this is serious here. I see what these guys been through, see what the goal is, see what the mission is, and it's just going to make me want to, you know, improve my game. So, you know, I think it's just a, a, a energy thing, a field thing that you just know, like, this is serious, you know, nobody's playing around. Everybody has one mission in mind, and we're striving towards that every day. Appreciate you. Thank you all.